All right, Monday, pretty crummy weather-wise, but yeah. the next few days looking a whole lot better. That's why we invented Tuesdays. <laughs> Tuesdays look much better. Let's go ahead and talk about this. We are starting your day off cold, so Tuesday also means jacket as we get the day started. Temperatures in the upper 20s. Sunshine will warm things up, but don't expect any kind of a balmy day tomorrow. Low 40s, sunshine with a chill, and by the latter part of the day, still mainly sunny. Low 50s, that is the cool side of spring. We had rain around today. Most folks, a quarter to a half inch. That rain, again, normal rain. It's not a deluge. It wasn't causing flood problems. It was just rain for a change. So now on the Max Track Live Doppler, quarter after 11, not much going on during the course of the last six hours. We watch waves of showers come through. That last batch is some light drizzle and sprinkles, just cold and kind of miserable at that. But it's gone. It's getting out of here. Through Wednesday, we're on the cool side of spring. For the latter part of the week, though, we get a surge of some springtime warmth and some really nice springtime warmth. But in the eight day, your rule of thumb is don't get used to it. We are still in that time of year where we see pretty decent temperature swings. So the cold swing comes tomorrow. We're starting off temperatures in the upper 20s to around 30 for most of us. It's cold air socks in the eastern third of the continent. We're talking our normal high temperatures are now starting to get to that 60 degree mark. That sounds good. We were close to 70 yesterday. Today we're in the upper 50s. Tomorrow it's low 50s. Normal on Wednesday. There's your surge of warmth that carries us into the first part of the weekend. But beyond that, okay, there's your surge of warmth on Saturday. But by the time we get you on into Sunday, cold air begins to take hold once again. And not just us. Good chunk of the country seeing some fairly cold stuff coming in for the early part of next week. It's a clammy feel out there for us this evening. Temperatures running low end mid 40s for most. 44 Monticello, 42 coming out of Jackson, 43 more. But look at Flemingsburg's only in the upper 30s. Bluegrass Airport, we sit at 43 with a north wind at 14. If you're walking the dog, the wind chill comes in at 36. So be prepared for that. Three tenths of an inch of rain fell at the Bluegrass Airport today. All righty. So the setup today. See it right there? See the counterclockwise spin? There's your upper level low. It's sliding off to the east. Meanwhile, thunderstorms were blossoming up across Tennessee, North Georgia. Your clearing line is pushing southward. It's just about to I-64 and working its way south. So that's what will greet you tomorrow morning. Low pressure is headed off to the east and away. High pressure is building in from the north. Now it's a cold Canadian high, so you'll have to endure the chill with it tomorrow morning. The low again heads off to the east and away. So high pressure gives us sunshine tomorrow, a brisk day. As we work our way then into Wednesday, the high slides to the east, out to our west. The winds begin to turn southwesterly and pretty briskly. So we'll see breezy weather coming in here for not so much Wednesday. Thursday, those will be a surge of warm winds coming in. That cold front has another shot of some pretty nasty cold behind it. That gets in here for the latter part of the weekend. It'll get here about the same time that storm rolls on through. That'll be your rain chance as we get to the latter part of the week. So tonight, whatever rains left in eastern Kentucky gets out of here quickly. Clearing sky, breezy, cold tonight. Down into the upper 20s, your day tomorrow. Low 50s, good deal of sunshine around, seasonably cool. Certainly a breezy day as well. Our highs are in the low 50s. We get you to Wednesday, we're going to push 60. Thursday, we're going to push 70. In the 70s, Friday, rain late in the day. Unfortunately, that carries us into the first part of the weekend. 